So I've kind of I've kind of made myself known for this idea that I believe in YouTube as an art form somewhat in the the old community that I used to sit around in caused this big big stir in that community over me uh, preaching these different opinions about YouTube they weren't very receptive about that um, a lot of people in that community specifically just kind of hated opinions that differed from theirs because initially the way I got into that community in the first place was just by uh, just by way of um, pandering more or less um, I the reason I, I the reason I got into that community, the reason I was so well accepted, was because I had openly agreed with almost everything they were saying without actually giving much critical thought to it. But, you know, it's just a, a dumb little kid. What am I gonna do? Um, and so by the time I started disagreeing with some of their ideas, they weren't really a fan of that. And this was one of them where I believed YouTube was an art form, and it was just this such a giant a drastically different idea that um, it caused a huge stir in that community among other things um, so yeah like I don't know to me discussing that idea would just seem like a business as usual kind of thing whether or not you agree with it but um, yeah so I've kind of made myself known for this idea that I believe that um, almost everything in a lot of ways is art Jesus Christ, what have I done? Ugh, that's better. Um, yeah, so I, I, that's, that's my belief. I believe that most things are, that most things are art if it has, if it's being created, more or less. Um, and the two ways I like to quantify this are if it can mean something to someone and if it's just being made in itself. Like, for example, um, if, let's say, a show like Aramanga Sensei, a lot of people would say this is a complete shill show that is horrible and shouldn't exist. Now, while I may agree with that, if someone was to watch Aramanga Sensei and get something out of it, that appeals to them so specifically and that makes them so emotional or if it's just their first anime and new things that like are staples in anime will impress them then that's just how that's just how they are you know uh, you can't you can't you simply cannot connect with them the same way uh, and um, then there's there's the other part of my criteria that I have where if it's something being made if it has a feasible amount of effort into it made to to make it a thing that's that's been created that exists then that in itself is art the words I'm speaking to you now is art this coffee maker is art um, the walls that were painted is art bricks are art I think everything is art everything that is is being created and that could have some kind of meaning behind it to someone is inevitably art and um, the reason why I bring this up is because Weeb Trash Productions made this vlog um, that he thought was bad and I it, it, was, it was it could have been tightened up a bit I'll say that but there was a point of contention I had with it just his idea of what makes analysis art like he was saying well you had people like Mr. Cynical and Horseshoe Finale and all these people who made these great amazing videos and they've proven they've proven that um, analysis videos are art and I don't agree with this I think videos have always been art since the first one uploaded to YouTube and I stand by that um, but I I also think that those videos are very very impressive and to someone who's getting into the getting into the medium those could amaze them it could pretty much amaze could amaze anyone fan or just getting into it um, but yeah I, I think it, it really comes down to 
if this is made, if someone put in the effort to make this, an artesian went and made something, or if um, it's something that can mean something to someone or does mean something to someone out there, that will make it art. Um, so, yeah, and I mean, I break my own logic on this all the time. Uh, I say, well, reaction videos can't be art because, you know, they're not b putting any effort into them or whatever. So I break my own logic on this all the time. I contradict myself on this all the time. It's kind of a, uh, no, it's, eh, I don't know. I really don't know where I'm going with this. It's like, it's just, just an, I just an idea that it can mean something to someone else. Because, like, well, I may sit here and say, you know, um, reaction videos is just stealing someone's content. What if there was someone else where reaction videos really meant something to them? I don't respect them at all. I don't think they're good content, but there's always a chance that there could be someone else who, who finds some kind of artful value in them, and in that case, it's more of a remix type situation. It's remixing the original content that's made, and they're putting something new over it, you know? Um, just not to the extreme that an analysis would, you know? So, I don't know, that's just my thoughts on that. Um, of course, feel free to disagree with me. I don't even really have this as like my hardline stance because I don't know. Sometimes I find flaws in the argument where I'm like, you know, what if this was like the thing? So I I don't know. I don't fully agree with that with that statement even as like a hardline kind of stance. I think it's just one one way to look at it. Um, but I think analysis videos themselves have always been art. Um, you know, if it's written, if it's a, a written thing making a point about a show, I think they've always been art, even without those giant, beautiful masterpieces um, like the Philosophy of Crea or like Horseshoe Finale or the Asterisk War Sucks or anything like that, you know. Um, or pretty much Pause and Select's entire catalog, because I've been getting into Pause and Select lately, actually. He's really, really good. Um, I, I, actually, I put him in my top ten anime YouTubers now, because he's really, really good, and I love him. Um, but, uh, yeah, that's just kind of the point I was trying to make here, is that I think analysis has always been hard. That's my opinion on that. This, is this thing out of water? Uh. Oh, oh, I guess it is.